In this video, we're going to look at the multiplication and division of negative numbers. When we have two, two positive numbers, we always get a positive result. When we have two negative numbers, when we multiply two negative numbers or divide two negative numbers or have two negative numbers in a fraction, we always get a positive number. However, if you have one negative and one positive, or a positive and a negative, when you multiply, when you divide, or when you have a fraction, that gives you a negative number. Let's look at some examples. If we have, here we can do some multiplying. 3 times 4. We know the answer. That's 12. But negative 3 times negative 4. Once again, two negative numbers. Negatives cancel. Some people call it same switch switch because you got the same ones and you can switch the signs. You also get 12, or just be clear if you want, you can put a plus right there. Positive 12. Ah, negative 3 and positive 4. No, we don't say positive right there. But if there's no sign, we know it means it's a positive number. Put a little positive there if you want to remember. Negative 3, uh, 1 negative, 1 positive. That means we have a negative 12. Likewise, a positive 3 and a negative 4 gives us a negative 12. Let's look at some quick examples here. Negative 1 and 2 negative 2. 2 and negative 1, 2 times negative 1, the answer is negative 2. 1 times negative 2, negative 2. 2 times positive 1, negative 2. If there is one, one negative and one positive, it's always negative. Let's take a look at some examples of division. If we have 2 divided by 4, you know the answer to that. That's 1 half. But negative 2 divided by negative 4. Notice we have two negatives. That gives us positive 1 half. We don't have to put the positive sign there if it's a positive. We just kind of know that, a po that one half and positive one half are the same thing. Sometimes we put the positive there just, to, just so we're being clear with ourselves. Negative 2 over positive 4. Oh, there's only one negative. Does that mean it's positive or it's negative? It means it is negative. Now, if it's negative, we always put the minus sign there. Likewise, 2 over negative 4. Same thing. Negative. Now, fractions and division are the same thing, but sometimes that confuses us. So let's just do this again with division, in simple division instead. 6 divided by 2. That's 3. Negative 6 divided by negative 2. Notice we have two negatives in there. That means we get 3. And it's a positive number. 6 divided by negative 2. Negative 6 divided by 2. Each of these, each of these have one negative and one positive. That means we get negative 3. Remember, when you are doing multiplication and division with negative numbers, two positives and two negatives gives us a positive number. One negative and one positive gives us a negative number. 